build stronger uh, public-private partnerships and how to, to uh, really stretch those federal dollars out as, as far as possible. Um, but broadband is a perfect example of a broader point that, that I wanna make. Um, you know, we're gonna get through this crisis uh, and when we do and we need to rebuild, uh, we don't wanna lose sight of the, the priorities that existed before. Uh, COVID did not eliminate inequities and disparities, um, but as I mentioned earlier, it's actually gonna make them worse. So it's hard to see this right now, um, but the governor and I ask you, you know, not to, to lose sight of this vision of all of us being connected and the vision that we had for one Minnesota before this hit. Um, but, you know, I, I feel you and I, I wish uh, we would be able to do something quickly to expand broadband to, to meet the need in this moment, um, but it certainly will continue to be a priority. And I think the, the urgency has only been underscored by this crisis that we find ourselves in. Mm -hmm. Yeah, thank you. Um, you mentioned One Minnesota, which made me think of a plug that I need to put in here for